Well, good morning peeps. This is Julia from Adventure Geek and today I'm doing a walk. I'm scoping a walk out on my own today, which is lovely. I've mapped it on all trails and it is apparently it's 10.9 miles. Um, so I'm looking forward to a nice day out. Saying that, I was meant to do this on Saturday. It's now Monday because we have had Storm Dennis. And as I was driving down, even though the sun's out and it looks like a glorious day, um, the fields have been completely flooded so I have no idea what I'm going to expect today whether I'm actually going to make the whole journey through or not I'm not really sure time will tell so uh, we're starting off at this small village called Stonesfield uh, just parked outside the church I've got 30 people actually 33 booked in uh, for this walk next Sunday so I think I'm gonna have to change the starting place because it's a little bit new at the moment but uh, what a fantastic village this is very Cotswoldy so anyway I need to figure out where I'm going and I'll check in with you later level is literally non-existent which is like yay at the moment we'll see we'll see what happens ah! there's me well as you can see that was a little bit of fun trying to cross this um, I don't know if you can see up here, um, it's completely flooded, I think this is obviously just meant to be a footpath, I'm just glad I'm not going that way, I'm going straight over, and the path is really dry the other side, I don't know that noise is, I don't know if you can hear that. This place is like going back in time with its little cobbled streets and yeah, Woodstock is lovely. steep and a little bit muddy um, so goo level was getting a little bit higher I've actually now got past it I don't know if you can see this but it's it's all flooded um, but looking sort of down that way uh, if I just show you so down there there's a sign um, and it looks like someone's actually put some like logs and stuff across so I'm gonna have a check that out and uh, looking at it I don't know if it's more dangerous to cross on those logs or just try and sort of hop over, it didn't look too bad, in the middle it's not that bad, it's not that deep, it's just there, so yeah, I know, I don't know, okay, I just had to go for it, so I literally just hopped over, no problem at all, so it wasn't deep, and uh, there's a nice high bit in the middle, so you can sort of go halfway, get your composure, and then hop over the next bit, 
I am so now I've just got to find the path. Now where did the path go? I'm gonna fly to you in this aeroplane. Alright, so uh still windy, nearly nine miles in now and literally just reached the small village of Coombe. It's a nice church just down here. So we're gonna whittle our way. Whittle? I shouldn't say that. We're gonna weave our way. Actually, I do need a widow. <laughs> I'm going to weave our way through the village and then uh, make our way out. I'll see if I can take some photos of the actual buildings as well because they're gorgeous. Look at this one. Tim's Cottage. Hold on. So I hope that you've enjoyed today's walk um, from Blenheim Palace or the Blenheim Palace Trail. Um, as you can see, the footpaths are really well maintained and I've, I've loved the walk. It's just been absolutely superb. As I said, I'm not going to start this walk when I'm leading a group for this next week. I'm not going to start it from Stonesfield. I'm going to start it from Woodstock. A, because it's a fantastic place to start. Lots of little coffee shops and the parking is free. So you can't get better than that. Um, so the walk for me today was 10.9 miles um, but obviously I've had a few squiggles I've, as I've been looking for trails and things like that plus I'm not going to go via Stonesfield I'm going to chuck uh, or cut this little bit out so that will probably take it down to about 10 miles maybe even 9.8 something like that when I actually leave the trail next Sunday so fantastic you can follow this on all trails um, if you want to do this walk as well and I'll put a link in uh, the notes below if you're watching this on YouTube and uh, yeah thanks for coming along with me don't forget Always get outside, get inspired and go take a hike. I'll see you next time. Take care. Bye-bye.